Guys, thank you for stopping by again. Quick little video today. I wanted to talk about the importance of having a book that's going to help you do as much research as possible. I've spoken to the, about this before, that uh, video didn't get a lot of traction, so I'm just going to do it again. And it's just going to be a quick little video. So, on this video, I'm going to concentrate on symbols. A lot of you guys buy watches out there and there is not a lot of information. There is not a lot of information and we're looking for anything that we could find on these watches. So what's incredible about this book right here, the complete price guide to watches. This is the 2012 and I have the 2017 here. 2018 is not out yet. So we'll go with this one. And I, let me see right here, right here. Your symbols on the watches, okay? This is very important for you guys to know and to be able to uh, date your watches to the date you want to go and to see who manufactured them. Th the symbols tell you a lot about your watch. So a book like this, it's not expensive. They're in the 20 US dollar ranges. And if you're into vintage, they're a must have. They're totally must have right here on this side. You have the letters and the year that stamp pertained to that letter. So guys, I cannot stress this enough. This is, we keep going right here. More symbols. And I can't stress this enough guys. If we go to the wristwatch side, another point that's very important. Like if you want to know what kind of, what are your hands called? You know, right here. Alpha hands. Your uh, dolphin hands. It'll tell you the shape of the hands and what they're called. Okay. So you get a lot of information for your $20 range book. Another thing. Your import stamps. You want to sometimes the, the name on the name on the front of the dial doesn't tell you much. But if you open up that movement, and on the on the balance bridge, you say you see the the three initials. I'm trying to focus here. Let's say it says H Y L. Now you know it's a Hamilton. You know if it says H Y O. Now you know it's a Hilton. So you'll see it on your balance. What type of watch you own, even if the dial doesn't give you much information. Now, now I'm blurring all out. Look at that. There we go. So even if the dial doesn't give you all that information or the watch case, here are the three letters on the balance bridge. And these are the import co codes for the, um, for the companies that imported them or exported them. So there's a lot of information guys here on a book like this that you could have, that you could pinpoint the year, the make, the model of your watch. So this is it. And I buy these religiously year after year. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Thank you. And if you like this, like and subscribe. Uh, the likes that you guys give me motivate me to uh, keep going and going. Thank you guys so much.